Oi. Hey, welcome back to YouTube channel, and today we're gonna be reacting to this video by our lovely space piano guy here, Voidside, the final act trailer. So let's let's get in let's let's get into it. Well, the yeah. If time still existed, I guess I'd be talking about the past. There's always been something, and there's always been nothing. All of time and space was supposed to exist simultaneously, overlapping itself but never colliding. That's what the Void was for. The Void was an entity that separated reality, ensuring that existence did not collide with itself. However, over whatever it substitutes for time, the Void grew jealous of existence. It hungered for light, for an Euclidean sense of being, and in that instant, in all times and places, reality broke. Whoa, the As the insane. Void seeped into reality, something else took its place. A Void of the Void, complete nothing. The pressure of this nothing shattered reality leaving small remnants of existence scattered and suspended in place. My world was not so lucky. Oh, that's so cool. These are... These are the enemies, right? Oh my god. Already in that first minute, we're getting so much information. That's a, that's a bit of void side. So, I'm assuming this is telling us that this... We play in the remnants of existence. Suspended in place. So interesting. My world was not so lucky. I, however, was. As I watched my reality crumbling around me, the void decided that it needed a host. Something physical. Something to truly anchor it to what was left of existence. It chose my brother. I tried to stop the void. But instead, I was left with a small part of the void inside me. Not enough to control me, but enough to give me immunity to the nothingness between worlds. I've since made it my mission to attempt to take my brother back from the void. Jumping from world to world, trying to find order among the chaos. My newest lead is an island at the center of the chaos. It's rumored to be harboring a keystone infected with a part of the void that neither me nor my brother could hold. That is so interesting. For those who don't know, they do know, don't know that. That there is what I think is the first level, right? Because you have a boat in the first level. I played a tiny bit of void side, but sadly my computer is a potato <laughs> in its lunch coat. <laughs> so uh, yeah, this means the first level. Okay, that's so cool. My brother could hold. That's really interesting. It's the best lead that I have. So, so because there's, okay, is there anything else in here? Should we not, right? No, okay. So, I'm assuming this guy here is a bad character, which makes this guy the brother. Wow. Okay, this is interesting. Let's, let's, I, I would do a frame by frame analysis of this, because obviously some of it uh, is just text. So, this seems to be a representation of the timeline, which reminds me of this thing, this thing here from from Marvel, the giant sleigh thing. 
Uh, and then eventually we got to see it breaks into pieces, which is really interesting to think about. So then the void has taken hold of seemingly this character. Because this is our player which is what I get here, unless unless I'm mistaken. Makes it this guy, this guy's brother. So yeah, the void took over this guy and it started to take over him, which we can see in the design of all the crystal fragments, which which I'm sure you, you you've probably seen. Yeah, that's our gun, has the crystals on it. But also everything's crystal which is like the void signature almost. This piece of art here is interesting. This is talking about presumably our player character. And this guy's home got destroyed. And these guys got taken over by the void, which is interesting. So I wonder what the purpose of these guys were before they became voided. <laughs> before they became void sided. <laughs> So that's some interesting theory speculation I could go over here in the future. That guy is a gun. <laughs> the enemies have guns? Yeah, they do, they have tiny guns. <laughs> Obviously, we have this bit where we can see the back of the boat, which is from Void Side. Uh, in the first level, we can see it. And then we get some lovely gameplay here, which I'll mute. But I'll I'll go for like quarter speed. We'll see if we can spot anything interesting. So this seems to be the city we are talking about earlier. Which is interesting, it seems to be all kind of fairly empty. Which makes sense, because the void is taken over. We've got some of the enemies we got to see in the first area of void side. I don't know if there's anyone new here. There might be, I'm not professional with the game. Yeah, one thing I noticed actually, these guys are different. If you look really closely, like even in quarter speed, if you just like look really closely, that guy is a diamond on his face. Whereas the standard enemies don't have things on their face, if you've noticed. So that could be a new enemy type, unless I'm wrong, and that enemy type already exists. We've got lights of drones back here that could be post-processing, but it could also be an enemy type I haven't encountered yet. Yeah, see, so here's a better example. A better example. Right here. We can see yellow face, not yellow face. So that's interesting central gameplay there. This seems to be a new environment as well. It's like a fallen down city with a sun or something in the center. So maybe that's a black hole. Which could be really interesting. Of course, we're going to visually be knocking it out of the park every single time, naturally. Yeah, this place, okay. This place is interesting. We see buildings in the background and lampposts and palm trees as well. So I'm curious as to where this is. Perhaps this is getting closer to the edge of worlds, to the nothingness where the void came from. And things are starting to collide and form interesting environments. So here we've got another city, seemingly. And we've got a keystone back there, I think that's what it's called. Interesting, nothing, nothing seems to be that new there. Or, you know, sort of, how does that sound? Oh, that sounds horrible. <laughs> that sounds horrible, slow it down. <laughs> yeah, we've got more looks at those enemies. I don't see much in the environment, there's two guys, look at this right now. And then obviously we have Void Side, where we have the title card, and we have the player and the brother. How interesting! Anyway, thank you guys for watching, that was my reaction to a Void Side of the Final Act story trailer. I would like, man, definitely, to subscribe to Space Guy and Epic Games, remember, remember to hit the subscribe button and then hit the bell, and definitely, definitely, uh, watch, definitely watch 
meat sliders they're pretty good i'll leave a link to them below i sadly didn't actually react to this one live on camera but hey hey you know you can't blame me so yeah definitely recommend recommend i haven't played the game fully yet i try to but i will definitely be doing a playthrough later once it gets a bit optimized so yeah i'll catch you next time